Welcome back to the show, everyone. Uh, Fiona has seen both the kind side and the slightly more frightening side it's of our next guest. the trainer side of our next guest, Tommy Europe. If you've ever watched the last 10 pounds boot camp, you know what I'm talking about. Well, he's got a brand new show as well we're going to talk about today. How are you, Tommy? I'm doing great. How are you guys doing? And you're not going to make me do burpees right now? No burpees. Okay, you're thank safe. you. Heels are too high. Uh, can you <laughs> illustrate the difference between the Tommy we're seeing now and the Tommy that people encounter when they're training with you? <laughs> this, is the, this is it. You, you get what you, uh, you see what you get. <laughs> a little bit. I've heard a slightly different well, story he's about... he's a good trainer. That's why. Well, it all depends. You know what? Every, everybody's a little bit different. Some people you have to be harder on and more yeah. serious. But I crack jokes all through. Is that I'm the key to being a, like a, a truly good trainer that can sort of get through to someone? Is is just yeah. figuring out that little bit of psychology of what Yeah, because everybody's a little different. Everybody needs a different source of motivation. They, you know, they react differently. So yeah. the faster you can tune into that, the I better. I need cupcakes. Like, cupcakes. if I'm going to work hard, I like, I want something <laughs> sweet Take, for and example, delicious. <laughs> me and my dear friend Karen, who trained together with you, what kind of approach did you have to take to two girls that tend to crack jokes as well and giggle a lot? Do you have well, to take a different approach? No, you, we can crack jokes, but you're going to work. You're going to work. <laughs> yeah. you know, See, some, that's the Tommy some, era. Some people try the Jedi mind trick and be like, so, hey, what about, and, you know, they're taking their rest. And I'm like, right, okay, they want to try and engage. Go, and oh, yeah. The distraction <laughs> technique. I know, I know all the tricks. Okay, well, let's talk about uh, the last 10 pounds. What's yes. going on? You guys are shooting a new We're season. We're shooting, shooting season six right now. Um, season six? Season six, wow. yeah. It's been, uh, it's been a wicked ride. Now, you are doing a call out as usual for folks who want to be involved, I guess. Yes. Um, if you go to my website, TommyEurope.tv, yeah. there's an application form in the bottom right. Uh, you can apply to the show. Yes, we are still looking. We'll be filming through, uh, through until October. Nice. And Tommy, do you have, uh, I mean, do you follow up with, with the clients that you meet in the last 10 pounds? I mean, do you get stories from them as they sort of progress? Because I think the interesting thing about the show is, is that you're trying to help people meet that particular goal. Whatever it is, mm -hmm. it's a big occasion in their life. But, but it's really, it reforms people's lives. Like well, it, it really it, has a... Yeah, it's a lifestyle change. And the ones who will adopt it, and I kind of have a pretty good idea of who's going to stick to it and who's not. Dude. Don't before, look at me. The, no. <laughs> I'm looking in this direction. I'm, I'm looking at everybody. Um, so I have a pretty good idea of who's going to keep up with it, who's not. Yes, I still do talk to a few of the contestants. And, yeah. you know, I see them in passing. And... You know, just make sure they're all doing okay. Some have had babies since. Um, it's been going for quite yeah. a while, so. Yeah. Must yeah. be nice for you, though, to catch up and, and hear the transformations that you have made with people. Definitely, especially the ones that stick to it. And it, it's a lifestyle change. And it's something, yes, it's a four-week period for last 10 pounds, six weeks for bulging brides. Um, but, you know, it's a lifestyle change. So yeah. you can adopt these things as part of your regular everyday life yeah well, and it's it amazing uh, the things that people just generally aren't aware of like the areas of ignorance that people have sometimes when it comes to diet lifestyle amount that they have to exercise how they have to yeah, exercise it, I mean that's the thing just just giving people that insight into it's, what it actually it's a little can. bit different obviously it's the exercise it's the nutrition and if you guys watch season six which I know you guys are going to yeah I am the nutrition guide as well oh you are you are? really <laughs> now Tommy let's talk about nutrition because a lot of times when you do I mean people People have their habits and sometimes they actually don't realize that they're bad. What are some of the faults that people, I mean we all know cupcakes are bad, we all know desserts whoa, 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 whoa. bad. Don't um, hate on cupcakes. You know what? But what are some of the things Portion that, sizes. Portion, portion sizes, sizes, sizes are very important. Um, for most of the contestants on the show, we have their meals split up into five, five meals throughout the day. Breakfast, lunch, dinner, uh, morning snack, afternoon snack. Now, why is that better to do uh, the five, the three meals and two snacks a day and eat throughout the day? Eating throughout the day, you're, you're going to be grazing. So smaller portions, you're going to be digesting your food, and you're going to be eating every couple hours. So your metabolism is constantly churning because you're digesting food. And for people who have the bad habit of not eating breakfast in the morning, maybe thinking, oh, if I skip a meal, I might lose worse. some weight. Well, what does that do that backfires? Well, it's like going to start your car and you forget your key. Okay. It's not, it's not going to work. <laughs> Your sad. metabolism will not start <laughs> until you actually start doing something. Right. And you have to eat something. You have to, you know, kickstart it. So the earlier you eat, breakfast obviously is the most important meal of the day. Um, the better off you're going to be. Nice. Okay, so Bulging Brides, uh, Last 10 Pounds, and uh, the new show, which we have the promo for, and I think we should probably just run it. I think we should. Awesome. Tell us about Ambush and uh, what this show is all about. It's a little bit hush-hush right now. I can't say too much about it. The Looks trailer, scary, Tommy. The trailer will definitely let you know a little bit about what's going on. But very excited. So you joined a gym. You thought no one would notice, but somebody told Tommy you're up. I don't know, but that <laughs> scares me. 
<laughs> Are you gonna sneak up at people while they're on the treadmill? Well, I might. You might. I might. I might. I might. You might see me somewhere throughout your workout, or you know. See, if I saw you, I'd work a little harder. <laughs> I love the nominate a friend idea. Uh, and I'm guessing, are you guys starting to look for people now already for ambush? I'm going to be starting to look in the next month. In the next so, month. Um, I got ambush.com is going to be running next week. I got okay. So that's one to definitely check out. And TommyEurope.tv, as I said, will have everything that's going on. For the last 10 pounds, yeah. you can get nominated there. Yep. Now, you're here for the wellness show as well. What are you going to be doing? I'm going to be doing a boot camp. Um, I'll be there on Saturday at 11.15 at the Wellness Show at the uh, Convention Center over here. Um, so 11.15, I will be doing a boot camp, doing some Q&A, meeting people, and uh, hanging out, uh, having a good time. What do people usually ask you? Do they go right to the, to the training aspect? or? You know, it, de or it depends where I am. I've, I've spoke at a few wedding shows. Yeah. <laughs> And you know, Not sometimes the questions are a little slanted. <laughs> sometimes brides are a little crazy. Just, just the little brides and the brides' mothers. <laughs> oh, is it the mother? yeah. oh, yeah. They'll sit there and they'll, you know, oh. My daughter's oh. getting married. Should oh. she? <laughs> oh, goodness me. Oh, dear. That would be tough. Hey, I, I, I don't know whether I'm, I'm venturing into, into territory that you don't want to talk about because I forgot to ask you before, but uh, can we congratulate you on Definitely. a new addition to your life? Definitely. You're a papa. I'm a papa. Tell two us weeks? about little Michaela. Got ba little baby Michaela, Michaela Marley. Aww. So she's two weeks old. She's adorable. She's a bundle of joy, definitely. You look fresh, man. I'm very impressed. As a father of three, you look <laughs> like you're like. Doo, doo, doo. I have a very understanding wife. <laughs> and, you you know. have a very lucky wife. <laughs> yes. Now uh, we want to talk about uh, training. Are you still training people if they want to train with you personally, not on TV? I'm Are doing, you still doing that? I'm doing it in bulks in spurts. It all kind of depends on when we're when we're filming. Because I'm doing a book as well, which is going to be out in January. Oh, you should really get out and do something with your life. Well, you know, you know, <laughs> you know. I've got a kid. I don't go out anymore, so I've got time. <laughs> Who knew that could happen? I got time and more money. You know, I'm not spending it in the bar. Now we've got to talk. Children to are the you best money savers of all time. Also yeah. about Canucks. Yes. What do you think the series? I didn't realize you played so much hockey. First of all, I was a goalie. I was a goalie. I was going to be the f the first black goalie, but then you know Grant came along. Grant Thanks, Fuhrer. Grant Fuhrer. You know, which I, I met him finally, and he was one of my idols. Oh, oh did you really? That's awesome. Yeah. But you were playing junior when you were. When no, you no, were... just I played MTHL in Toronto, wow. and then uh, basically I basically had to choose between hockey and football. In Good grade choice. 12. Chose so football. I chose football. Way more money in Canadian football. Well, the real story <laughs> is our home nights for our home games when I was playing were Friday nights. I was in grade 11, so. <laughs> Do the math. <laughs> wow. You don't want to burn a home night. No. Or a, no. Yeah, no. a Friday night. I don't no. know. But back to the Canucks. Day. What do you think they're going to take it in? Canucks are going to do it in six. Okay. All right. Definitely. I'm down with that. Stuff. I still, I, I think Brandon and I are right, though, with the five. But I'll let well, you have I, the I figure six. Chicago's going to take one of these games. They're playing in Chicago. It's, you know, they'll all be right. all hyped up. But then Canucks will come back here and do their thing. We'll I see. agree. You know, it would be really fun for me to beat you in something. So, you <laughs> there know. you go. A bat. <laughs> Chicago, if you could hold suck on, hold on. Where do you train again? Uh, Upstairs by himself. In my head. <laughs> <laughs> Look at how skinny and weak he is. <laughs> the wellness They call show. me the ball peen hammer as well. <laughs> wow, if you missed the last interview, that's so out of context. You're just going to have to rewind your PBR. Uh, the Wellness Show is happening April 30th to May 2nd at the Vancouver Trade and Convention Center. If you want to check out Tommy, your Saturday, uh, May 1st at 11.15 a.m. And if you want to find out more about the last 10 pounds, you can go to the website. You can go to TommyEurope.tv to find out everything that's going on with Tommy. The brand new show, Ambush, that website Oof, will be launched be soon. Good. But in the meantime, you can just check out on Tommy's site to, uh, to find out all the info. Tommy, thank Definitely. you. Congratulations. You're thank you, guys. You're a tremendous father. Well, Lucky I'm looking girl. forward to it. Like I'm gonna get We're going to take a break and come back uh, with more on Urban Rush right after I do, what is it, 30 burpees I have to do? Is that my punishment? <laughs> I'd like to that? see that. 30 burpees. <laughs> <laughs> One, two.